Hello YouTube! We're not dead yet. We're not quite dead yet. We're, we're not quite dead yet, and we're gonna we're gonna win. We're gonna survive. We're gonna win. Uh, Twisted officers in in grave danger. But he's developed immunity just as I clicked that. So ha! Huh. And uh, meanwhile, this is not going well. Um, I mean, it's going better than it could be. He's two percent higher on immunity than infection. So so I think Billy Shark will survive this. I think we'll all survive this just barely. Oh, drag is fancy for a worker. That makes sense. I'm not I'm not much on the fancy speak myself. I like the I like the simple speak. An Ibex ram has self-tamed. Okay, sure. Well, we'll slaughter you. That's fine. Jump to location. Slaughter. Good. Yeah, medical emergency. We knew that was coming. It's Billy Shark's problem. Oh, there's a fire. Uh, it's not going to spread there. Oh, it is. It's totally going to spread. Hey, Twisted. Um, oh, yeah, you're tending. That, that's important. Do that first. After that, put out the fire, please. Not in home area. Okay, well, home area then. Um, oh, shoot. That's that's bad. That's really, really bad. Uh, so, um, zone. Expand home area, I think. Yeah. Expand, expand it to that as well, please. Okay, go put out the fire before it spreads. I said before it spreads, not after it spreads. That's the wrong order of things. Okay, good. Twisted officer's now fully healed. Holy cow. Okay. Oh, and Billy Shark can't move. He's so sick. He's okay, though. Immunity's 4% higher than infection. That's, that's going to be fine. Just barely, but it will be. Probably also bury the corpse, maybe. Hey, Twisted. Um, oh, you're feeding a meal? Okay, well, once you're done that, just, just, uh, please bury Seymour. Okay, okay. Oh, we should unforbid this, or it's, it is already unforbidded. Okay, good. Oh, you're not supposed to be hauling right now. Oh, you're sleeping, I see. Solar flare? Uh, that's an old news. Old news. Yes, this place will be formed. It'll be okay. Um, that's a lot of fire. I didn't notice that. Huh. Um, oops. Rain? Rain? Uh-oh. Uh-oh, there's, there's, there's lots of fires. Um, rain. Let's do this. Let's, uh... Death Ibex Ram. Okay, yeah, whatever. That's We did that on purpose. Let's, um... Make that home area as well, so that if the fire expands to the base, we will put it out. But not before then. And over here, I'm just gonna choose not to care, and I'm gonna pretend it's gonna rain in time. I hope. Same with here. Oh, Slick Sack. Slick is on it. And Billy Shark is now on it. <laughs> Just doing the minimum possible fire putting out here. Uh, let's actually uh, expand the home area a little bit so that we put out all of this, this little bit of fire right there. Oh, and this Ibex should be allowed. We should really be hauling this food indoors. Twisted's on it, I guess. Twisted's gonna cook first, but after cooking, he'll be hauling. So that's fine. Hey, once you awake, the first thing you should do is at least haul a little bit of this corn. Oh, and this uh, is allowed? Yeah, it's fine. <laughs> you know what? Actually, I'm going to clear... Oh, man, this is not good. Like, um... It hasn't rained yet, and the fire keeps spreading in all directions.
Major break risk. Oh no, what's what's wrong, guys? Insulting spree. Slick. How dare you? Gonna insult Billy Shark? Don't drive Billy Shark into another rage of punching things, please. Our precious, precious forests. Minor break risk. I like that a lot better than major. What's your problem, Slick? You say, you say you're still hurt? Oh, it's, just, it's fine. Yeah, Twisted, you tell him. Twisted's holding this whole, like, operation together right now, I think. He's cooking food and everything. Oh, it's back in the home area. Let's, uh, actually get our guys to put out this little bit of fire here. Uh, I'm gonna go expand home area this stuff here. Just just put out all of that fire, please. Yeah, I'm not too concerned about the fire right now. It's, it's far enough away. We'll just put out this little area, I guess. Yeah, you guys, help out. Oh, it's raining! Hey! The fire... Look, look at this. The fire's gonna go out eventually. Oh, joy. Okay, good. Back to work. More thunder. I'm going to expand the home area to include all of this area that, that's within our walls. Because um, that will let us like get on top of, of future fires in time. Maybe it's ambitious to try to, like, control this whole region, but sure. Okay, sure. Ship to the stars! Starship hidden on the planet. I mean, I don't really care, you know? Uh, let, let's check out where it is. It's, um, way, way over here. That's, like, a long ways away. Uh, I don't, I don't care. I'm not going to trash it, though. I'll just leave it up just so, so it stays on the quest log. I'm actually going to tell these doors to stay open here. Because that way the temperature will, will go below freezing in these, in these little food preparation zones. Okay, so let's look at this again. Um, Billy Shark, go back to constructing as your primary job rather than cleaning. Things are clean enough for now. Meanwhile, we should really set up some animal uh, animal exclusion zones where our food is. So let's... Um, how do we do this? Um, zone. Right? Hmm. Oh, right, 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 right. Manage areas. New area. Uh, rename grazing animals. And then um, 
Okay, and then expand grazing animals. We'll just tell the grazing animals, don't go in here. Don't go where we're making food happen here. And uh, don't go in the house. And then we will invert areas. How do we do that? Uh, manage areas, invert. Okay, good. And then uh, animals, donkey one, grazing animal. Okay. Hey, it's traders. You darn stinking traders. Um, okay, so who is is our social helper person? Um, Billy is seven, and the rest suck. Billy's our Billy's our our trader. He's a trader, trader to the cause. Go trade. All right. Hey, this is a lot of stuff. You get yaks. You can get a male and a female yak. Um, I don't think we have enough value, though, to trade for that stuff. Um, we should probably take all the herbal medicine right now. Or maybe not, because we'll have herbal medicine soon. So so what's, what's important here? Um, we actually have a lot of cloth sitting around. We might want to tell them to start doing tailoring soon. Could probably sell all our meat. Yeah, we don't care about meat. It sells for a dollar each. And our leather, I suppose. Um, all the leather we don't really want. Camel hide's going to be important. That's a really good leather for us. Panthera fur is um, really fancy, right? It's good at heat. It's very beautiful. Um... Unfortunately, it is warm in this climate, so I don't think panther fur is going to help us much. So we'll sell all of that. We'll sell the wolf fur. Uh, fox fur is also very beautiful, right? But it's... Oh, that's weird. Look at this. When you're wearing fox fur, your, your minimum temperature is 20 and your maximum temperature is 16. So that doesn't seem useful at all. And we don't care about beauty right now. We will later. And we might as well keep the plain leather. We're going to get rid of the light leather. So that's something. Um, what else? What do we want here? They don't have much that we really, really, really want. Uh, we might want to just take some basic building materials. Um, can we afford the yaks? I mean, we can. We can just buy two yaks. A male and a female, and they'll breed and stuff. We'll have lots of yaks. What do yaks do? They're grazing animals. Um, good carrying capacity. Good leather amount. Um, can they be milked? Is there yak milk? Where do we find that? I don't know. Eh. I think we want yaks, don't we? I think we want yaks. Let's get yaks. Uh, and what can we trade? We actually have a lot of corn at this point. We, we have, like, more corn than we're going to need anytime soon. So, um... I don't know. Let's uh, do 200, 200 corn. Really? Number pad's not working? What? I don't understand why that's not letting me assign a number. Oh, it should be minus. I see. Minus 200. Sure. And, uh... I mean, we should probably grab the herbal medicine. Though, and we can find herbal medicine on the map. We don't care. Yeah, you should be able to milk yaks, right? Yeah, yak milk's a thing. Yak milk's totally a thing. Pretty sure. Sell our go juice. That's the, the, the raider brought go juice for us. We can sell the synthread pants that we're not using um, because they've been punched. They were at like 90% before they got punched a couple of times. And um, then we'll still have 200 gold left. That's worth doing. I, I want the yaks. I want yaks. Yaks are good. Okay. Those are now our yaks. We'll set them to grazing animal. They cannot be uh, trained, unlike the donkeys, but they'll just sit around breeding for, for us, and that's nice. We got a bit of relations. We got relations up to one for that trade. It's 30 Celsius. Uh, our, our freezer is maintaining a sub-zero temperature, so that's nice. Might want to rebuild the research station since it was destroyed in the in the raid. 
I mean, sure, sure would be nice if some raiders would come in while these traders were hanging around. We should probably set um, plant plant cutting to happen. So, S Sax, you just do some plant cutting. Don't wor don't worry about research right now because we don't have a research bench anyway. Might have assigned too many fields, I suppose. This early in the game. Let's make sure that we cut all the plants inside the house. We'll tell it to cut so that the, the one who can actually cut plants will do it. And we should haul this stuff, right? Oh, not, not, the, uh, not the little defensive structure. We're doing a great job of building these walls. We'll start any time now. Now let's turn off the marble. We don't need any more marble. Go away. Billy Shark, again? Man, how do we, like, make you happy or something? You're, you've been insulted, your bonded animal died, unsightly environment, says you! I think this environment is very sightly. You can see it, look, it's, it's, it's visible. It's visible, is what I'm saying. Let's also assign uh, chop wood, sort of everything in this little region here. Now, I'm going to uh, set up some uh, slightly better food stockpiles here. So we want stockpile zone. I'm just going to pause for a second there and there. Uh, this one will clear all uh, foods, raw food, uh, vegetarian. And this one, clear all uh, raw food, meat. Not human meat, though, and not insect meat. So human meat off, uh, insect meat also off. Uh, and then both of these can be priority uh, important and important. And then that'll make cooking happen a lot faster. And actually, I'm going to tell you uh, to haul some corn. Alcohol and drugs. Yeah, we don't have any alcohol. We, we are still making a lot of smoke leaf uh, joints, though. We should be anyway. Is it not being harvested? It's not grown quite yet. Okay, sure. <laughs> Riot because of no drugs? I don't know, man. We can't we can't make alcohol yet. Let's haul some more of this. We're getting a good stockpile of meals going now. That's nice. The throne room's coming along. It's very important. Hey, Yak, you're not supposed to be in there. Uh, clear allowed area grazing animals. Yeah, grazing animals don't belong in the throne room. That's like rule number one. No grazing animals in the throne room. Yak, I'm talking to you. Hey, out of there. Okay. Maybe we should like make this smoke leaf growing zone a little bit bigger, even if it's in the shitty soil. I think that's probably a good idea. So, um, expand zone, we'll just do that. More smoke leaf. Minor break risk, that's way better than major break risk. Can't ask for anything more. Trade caravan's leaving, so we're vulnerable again. Billy Shark's finally building this wall after so long of not building the wall. Slick, slick, slick is getting on all of the smoke leaf growing, and that's nice. Oh, there's an injured cougar. It's a little bit scary. Fortunately, our yaks are big enough to handle themselves. Might need some more graves pretty soon, but soon is not now, so that's okay.
Major break risk, Billy. Ugh. Is it because of the scratch scar? Better not be. Yeah, it's just this this Lolita, man. Billy Shark, you, you, you're just so obsessed with Lolita. That's that's not good, you know? Like, you should have learned from Nabokov. He taught the, the true way of resisting temptation. I think that's what the book was about, right? Resisting temptation? I think so. Hey, Cougar. What are you doing? You know what? Just so that throne room looks a little bit more symmetrical, we should probably install the other throne. Oh, it must have decayed outside. Oh, no, here it is. Here it is. We'll install the second throne next to the other one, even though you only really need one throne, but it'll look better. Once we have a nice gold throne, it'll look really nice right there. Billy Shark, you are so terrible at cutting things. Hey, Slick, help him out, please. Just... Do the work. Really? Low food again? Oh, because it's not officially in storage. It's sitting here. Are you the one who won't haul? Yeah, you are. Uh, haul. Yeah. I told you to haul. There you go. Hey, Twisted, before you cook, you should haul some corn in from the fields. Make it easier on yourself. Actually, do it a, do it a few times. The floor is almost done. Hey, once this floor is done, and it is now, that means this is officially a, a workable throne room, I'm pretty sure. I think we have everything we need. Look at that. Look at that throne room. We should consider building bedrooms, but I don't think we're there yet. I'm going to build bedrooms right along the outside of, of, the, of the whole camp. So that the bedrooms will sort of provide, like, a pseudo-larger wall, kinda. Hey, look! Yeoman Ceremonies appeared again, probably because we have a throne room. Well, we have ten days. We can wait a little while. Let's, let's like, do these necessary tasks that we're trying to accomplish here first. And I'm going to, uh, again, assign it to just cut all the stuff around here, maybe. I don't know. Maybe not quite yet. These these n new baby trees can't can't survive. Like, we we got to, like, get on the cutting of things. It's Billy Shark's job. He's slacking. Twisted's doing well. Look look at Twisted. He's, he's cooking all sorts of stuff. He's cooking up a storm. He's still, like, pretty terrible at cooking, I'm pretty sure, but... Four, and no, no, uh, no fire at all for it. We should also, uh, be really worried about cleaning here. Um, hey, Billy, I'm gonna, like, adjust your numbers here a little bit. Um, I want you to take cleaning a bit more seriously, and then construct after you're done cleaning, I suppose. Look at this. This is, like, almost all constructed, though, so that's good. Uh, I'm going to put in a uh, fancy, fancy electrical light in here, or two, maybe. Standing lamp. Um, right in the middle of the room, maybe. Something like, well, either side of the door, so it looks all fancy. How about that? And then we'll put in some more, um, what was that? Food poisoning. Dirty cooking area. Well, I told you to start cleaning. It's your own fault for not cleaning, right? Something like that. Yeah, Twisted, you're doing well. You're the only one helping out here. There's more Ambrosia. Uh, right here, right next to the kitchen. Look how convenient that is. Meanwhile, the old Ambrosia's probably done done growing, right? It was up here somewhere. Yeah, here it is. It's totally harvestable. When in doubt, we'll satisfy ourselves with... Why is there a wooden stool out here? 
Um, maybe uninstall. I must have done that by accident. <laughs> oh, I'm such a I'm such a good leader. I'm such a good leader for y'all. I'm I'm just assigning tasks just just perfectly. Yeah, this is going well. You twisted. Once you're done hauling that, you should uh, haul some of this corn. And then also some smoke leaf. Look, guys, we got smoke leaf. As soon as, like, some slacker gets on, like, preparing it, you guys will have your drugs that you want so much. Then you'll be happy, right? You'll be satisfied forevermore because of the existence of smoke leaf joints. Should probably have the crafting area in here, actually, now that I think about it. Let's do that. Oh, and we should be using this auto pistol that we uh, we were donated earlier. So let's, um, uh, I guess, deconstruct there. And then um, production uh, crafting spot in here, like there maybe. And then uh, bills, add bill, smoke leaf joint times four, do it forever. Good stuff. Maybe someone should repair this table. Major break risk immediately became a minor break risk. Probably because of the smoke leaf. Um, oh no, maybe not. Just cleaning up. Okay, that's fine. You clean away. Oh, puke on your food. That's nice. Look at that. He put his food on the ground and then puked on it. Very nice. Yeah, Billy, stop puking on your food. You might be happier if you don't puke on your food. Just just saying. Harvest these smoke leaves that are near the base. Or smoke leaves, these uh, heel roots. Oh, and we're growing heel root now. That's good. You know what? I'm going to um, go to numbers here, and we're going to turn all the medical care back down to herbal medicine in until there's some like emergency that requires us to use what little proper medicine we have left. We have uh, 14 proper medicine sitting here. I wonder if I should assign for people to do ambrosia when they're at like really poor. Um, yeah, let's do that. Let's use the ambrosia. Uh, what, what can possibly go wrong? It's not like anyone will be addicted to ambrosia, it, 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 probably. Um, so select policy, rec social drugs. Um, ambrosia. Oh, yeah, no, we've already told them to use ambrosia. Okay, good. Good. That's what we want. Except I'm going to lower lower this down to, like, 30%. So, like, only use this if you're very, very upset. Only the, the ambrosia is the, the sort of last resort. And meanwhile, um, which one of you was the, the cutter again? That's Slick Sax. Yeah, Slick Sax. Um, you should uh, prioritize cutting ambrosia bush, please. What are you doing? You're staring at the stars. Just just staring. Just just sitting there staring. Staring at the stars. Maybe we should uh turn this into the happy space that we intended it to be. So let's uh let's make people happy. We'll do recreation, uh billiard table maybe. Um like that. Oh, standable on all sides. Um, oh, right, because of the, the rocks. Whatever. Mad alpaca? What would you have to be upset about, alpaca? Uh, Billy Shark's in really rough shape here. Um, yeah. The severe pain and the, the trouble moving and everything, it's a scratch scar, apparently, that's the problem. Oh, and food poisoning. Sure, okay, whatever. So, um, Twisted Officer, you're in charge of fending off that threat. The alpaca threat. Uh, you're standing, you're, you're right here. Why don't you sit in the, oh, yeah, sit in the doorway. And, yeah, that'll work. Uh, Slick Sacks, you have a, oh, right, you, you no longer have your knife. Um, where's your knife? It's up here. Equip the knife, and then, oh, draft first, and then equip the knife, and then go out here to assist Twisted Officer. Shoot him. Haha! -ha. Shoot him! 
What are you doing, alpaca? Where are you going? Okay, advance. Oh, advance slightly less. Ha ha! Good job, Twisted. You have saved the day. Uh, meanwhile, Slick Sacks, undraft, please. Yeah, Twisted. Large and in charge and holding a bolt action rifle. Billy Shark, you should probably trade your revolver for the auto pistol. That'll make you much more effective. Do that whenever you're done, whatever you're doing. Oh, look at Twisted. He's the best. He's the best pawn of all the pawns. Sorry, guys. Sorry, guys. Twisted Officer wins this round. He's been so effective the entire game. He's been shooting alpacas and cooking meals and all sorts of stuff. It's real good. Love to see it. Meanwhile, Billy Shark with his, like, look at me, I'm so unhappy. Oh, boy, I'm in intense pain, and my bonded animal Lolita died, and oh, boy. I feel for you, Billy Shark. I really do, but but get with the program. Come on. We got we got moving and shaking to do. If you're not moving and also shaking, you're, you're slacking. Okay, when you're done cooking that, just pr haul those meals out and then uh, haul this smoke leaf, maybe. So who's the crafter around here? It's Twisted. Oh, Twisted, you're doing everything. So once you're done hauling the smoke leaf, I want you to prioritize making the smoke leaf. It totally is a popularity contest. Everything in life is a popularity contest. Otherwise, how would we know how important we all are? Quest available, hosting an ally. Okay, let's look at this. Gabriella Wasp Benzo, Chief of Gorar Pact, is requesting a favor. Her friend Dolphin Ambas is interested in learning about other cultures. She wants you to host him at Affection's Pit for 21 days. Ambas will not do any work. Okay, well, that's good. I think that's really good. So, um, we could get this, this, uh, this Tets, Tet, Tetsuya... Uh, how's Tetsuya? I mean, that's not terrible. The incapable of dumb labor is a problem. Um, we do want someone who can mine, but I mean, uh, I don't know. I don't really like this, this Tetsuya very much, so let's not do that. There's a Psy Trainer. What does that do? A one-use superdose of Mechanites, which trains a specific psychic power. This dose is administered through the orbit of the eye, which sounds awful, by the way. Once released into the brain, the mechanites form knowledge of an ability, um, and the ability is pain block. Blocks pathways in the target's brain for a short time. Can allow a person to move and act even with grievous injuries. That actually sounds super helpful. Okay, so, uh, and then mind screw. Uh, inflicts continuous pain on the user. Mind screws are used by some authorities as long-term punishment. Some even install them voluntarily as demonstration of ideological or religious devotion. Hmm. That sounds less useful, even though it sounds very fun. Maybe we should just do it for goodwill. I think goodwill would be good. We do want to have goodwill with the Gorar Pact. Um, I don't know. What do you guys think? I think we should do it for goodwill. Let's do it for goodwill. How about? What do you think? Uh, I'll leave it alone for now. We'll just get, get rid of that screen, and I'll wait until chat maybe maybe chimes in, and or, or not chimes in. I don't know. You, know. you do you. I'll do me. But... um. If if you if you all think goodwill's good, then we'll do that. If you want the um, the 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 weird abilities, psychic abilities, then we can do that too. We're definitely going to accept the quest for sure, though. I sell pack and needs to be butchered. Hey, twisted, uh, you're busy doing smoke leaf, I know, but but then haul the alpaca after you're done that. Goodwill sounds nice. Yeah, I agree. I agree. That's where I'm leaning as well. Slick Sacks is getting really good at the whole, like, growing food thing. Um, eight. Eight plants. Enough for the smoke, or for the heal root. Maybe we should expand the heal root field. That seems good, even though it's not, like, uh, it's not a good growing area, but whatever. It's fine. It'll grow eventually.
Oh, Twisted, you're all about the smoke leaf, I see. Let's tell more of these wild heel, heel roots to harvest. The trouble is we've like assigned so many plant cutting jobs right now, trying to clear out this area that um, our, our plant cutter is not doing important things like harvesting ambrosia over here. I see there's some ambrosia that's rotting in the, in the sun out there, but sure, it's not a big deal. Billy Shark's still like really, in, in, really unhappy here. Ravenously hungry. Well, what are you doing? There's plenty of food around. Well, you're eating now. That's something. Okay. Twisted. What? Ravenously hungry. Okay. Um. You know what? No. Uh, consume meal. You've done enough. Enough. Uh, making smoke leaf. That's that's okay. Visitor. Oh, good. Hello, orange. Got Orange Cassidy over there. It's good. We'll see about trading once he gets a bit closer. I'm going to uh, turn off this zone. That shouldn't be there because we really want the uh, animals in here. Did I turn that on? Yeah, animal corpses. Okay. I guess I assigned Twisted to do crafting ahead of, of uh, cooking, and I, I um, did not. Okay, you know what? Craft down to two. Finish those smoke leaves and then take a break. Look at all this food rotting in the fields. It's lovely. I really have assigned too much growing, haven't I? Uh, so let's shrink this uh, potato zone. Oh, that's, uh, that's the, the, yeah, this is, um, smoke leaf. Let's shrink that as well. Do that, and then, um, shrink that. That should be fine. We'll let the stuff we've already assigned grow here, and once it's grown, we'll tell it manually to harvest. Meanwhile, Billy Shark was our social, social animal, our social butterfly. So why don't you go trade Billy Shark? Look, Billy Shark's mood's really high now, somehow. Oh, it would be the smoke leaf and the ambrosia. See there, Billy Shark? All you need is, like, smoke leaf and also ambrosia, and you too can be satisfied with life. Poor health. Oh, boy. Whatever. It's too bad we don't have more smoke leaf joints. That would be really good to trade. Same with the ambrosia. Oh, well. We could trade cloth. We have tons of that. We could trade the revolver. We don't need it at the moment. Let's... Um, no. We can trade it later. That's fine. l Helm. I mean, we can't afford that. There's no way. It's too bad he doesn't have components or something. He has beer. We should probably grab the beer, because we can't actually make our own beer. So, if we grab the beer and then trade the smoke leaf joints and the ambrosia to pay help pay for it, because uh, we can always make more of those. Just trade for seven, eight beer, something like that. That's probably good. And then we'll trade the, the, the knives and the bows that the evil invaders brought us. And that seems fine. Get some beer. Look at Billy Shark. He's right on that. He's just grabbing the beer. So, you know, you know, Twisted, you know how I told you you didn't have to make more smoke, smoke leaf joints for a while? I'm changing my mind. You should make more smoke leaf joints. You're asleep right now. Okay, so once you wake up, I'm going to tell you to first... Uh, Consume a meal, and then make more smoke leaf joints. This run's been remarkable. It's It's been remarkable in that uh, we haven't had that many people attack us yet. Like, it, it's actually been very lucky. Uh, usually expect some more, some more baddies to show up before now. But since we handled the baddies so poorly, we're actually really, really lucky that they haven't shown up. So let's accept that quest. No one said anything I don't think about something other than goodwill. Nope. So we'll accept for goodwill. Now Ambus has arrived. Hello, Ambus. You're going to eat all our stuff and, sm like, you know, smoke all of our drugs, aren't you? Oh, we need an extra bed for Ambus, too. Oh, boy. Well, this medical bed, for temporarily at least, will be Amos's bed. 
We should really get on like building some proper bedrooms, but at the same time, like how, how, why, like we, we've no free laborers really to do that kind of thing right now. All right, Twisted, eat your meal. And now make your joints. Excuse me, your marijuana cigarettes. Okay, so uh, Twisted's the only one awake and doing stuff other than Ambass, who's just going to be a pretty big pain in the butt for a while. Hey, there's a party! Ambass is throwing a party! Well, that's good. You've done something helpful already, Ambass. That was nice of you. Oh, we got a gift! Three components. We should make sure we haul those indoors before they go bad, but let's do it after the party. Hey, Twisted, you can just clear your prioritized work because I want you to party. I want you to party and celebrate and party down. Why are you hauling wood? You're supposed to be partying. We also should really have someone doing cleaning because that, that hasn't been happening. Um, and Billy Shark should be prioritizing cleaning above, like, anything else. So, Billy Shark, what are you doing? Just get on it. Okay. The party has finished, and no one actually paid any attention to it or joined in the festivities at all. So that's disappointing. Disappointed in you guys. You should know how to party. Hey, Twisted, when you're done whatever you're doing, drinking beer, yeah, when you're done drinking beer, you should haul that, that component, please. Um, meanwhile, I think I'm going to actually change the drug policies again and tell them to use, like, Ambrosia at most every second day, maybe? Um, every two days? Yeah, and same with the beer, because we really don't have very much beer. In fact, that should be every three days. Just use it as you need it. There's very little. Yeah, you're right. You're right, Twisted. Like, proper bedrooms are very, very important. Um, but, like, I mean, we're, we're really just... Like, I don't know. <laughs> we have so much to do, and... Yeah. We're just trying to prioritize. I think we spend a bit more time growing food than we should be, realistically. Like, we've been just growing and growing and growing. Uh, let's turn off some of this corn. Shrink zone, like so. And... Oh, that's, uh... I just shrank the part that's the good, good growing area, right? I think. Wait, an idle colonist? Oh, it's Ambus. Yeah, yeah. No, I shouldn't be shrinking the area that's that's uh, proper growing zone. Oops, did not mean to do that. Screw you. Uh, shrink zone, that one. Expand zone. All of that. Uh, that, and that, and that, and there. Okay, sure. We could actually probably turn uh, the growing priority down below plant cutting for a while. That That's that's smart. Slick sacks, don't worry so much about growing crops. Just worry about cutting the, the wild stuff for now. Oh, the research is totally lacking. That's a really good point. By allowing the research to take a, a back seat, we're screwing over our future. And our future is very important. The future is tomorrow's best friend, I think. So, um, let's build a chair. Okay. So, Billy was the construct guy, and I turned down construction so he'll clean ahead of construction. That might be a mistake. I mean, cleaning is very important, but I think you've caught up on cleaning for now. So, let's, let's get you constructing things. Well, you've done the smoke leaf, the ambrosia, and the alcohol. You must be very happy indeed. Hmm. Working on the, the exterior wall. I mean, I guess that's a pretty decent priority. Kind of hoped you'd do the research bench, so why don't we force that? I'm 
I'm actually going to go back up to top speed. I've been on medium speed for a while. And that serves nobody's purposes. It is. It's very peaceful. I'm okay with that, though, because, like, we're, we're just, we're slacking. Like, we're, we're being big, big old slackers, and we just know that Randy Random's going to throw us, like, a whole lot of raids, like, one after another after another pretty damn soon. So all the time we can spend preparing is is really important. Um, so, Billy, once you're done sleeping, do the dining chair. And uh, Slick Sacks, uh, I really do want you to, to do research, but... I need you to catch up on plant cutting first. Meanwhile, I think Twisted, I'm going to tell you to haul ahead of cooking for a while. Because we need to get all this food hauled in. And we have plenty of meals. We have 29 meals at the moment. So Slick Sax is working on all the cutting. He's going very quickly. Cache of value. Oh, no, 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 no. A cougar is hunting slick sacks for food. Okay, slick sacks run through the door. Get away, get away, run, run. Um, meanwhile, um, who's there to help? Billy Shark has a has a, has a gun. Draft. Um, you go out this way. Wait, slow, please. Oh, that's that's just really not smart, is it? Run, run. Get away. Huh. Well, this is trouble. Hey, Twisted, stop, like, just lazing around and start using your gun for, for productive purposes. Now, Billy Shark, um, is gonna go after Twisted for a while. So, like, Twisted, run inside. Hide. Temporarily hide, please. Okay. Just advance a little bit, Billy. Okay, back off. Twisted, out the door. Shoot. Okay, good. Billy, in. What's going on now? What's your health? Dead in 13 hours. That's that's good. Billy, back out. Shoot. Twisted, what are you doing? Why aren't you shooting? What are you doing? You're, you're shot. Are you just running away now? Is there someone out there that you're hunting? I don't know. Okay, Twisted, just go to the door. Um, Billy Shark, undraft for now. Just get your rest or whatever. Whatever you're going to do. Hey, this thing's recently dead, right? It's fresh. Dead donkey. Wait, is that our donkey? No, it's not our donkey. It's a, it's a, a, a mystery donkey. Okay. Oh, he's hunting the turtle. Cool. He's going to be dead in 13 hours, and he's spending his time hunting a turtle. Okay, so that's fine. Undraft. Oh, you know what? Not a good time, Twisted. Like, priorities, man. Like, don't call the frickin' corpse now. Uh, we'll forbid that temporarily. Go the other way, please. Sure, you can haul wood. That's fine. Billy Shark self-tending. That's, that's okay. How's the cougar doing? He's really not dying that quickly, but he's eating the turtle, so that's good. I keep seeing this colonist's idol thing and thinking like, oh no, but it's just, just our, our visitor. Eating the turtle. Yeah, Billy and Twisted were our team of like, you know, going back and forth between hiding and shooting. Good old hide and shoot. Good job, Cougar. I enjoy that you're slowly eating a tortoise while also bleeding to death. Makes me very happy. Got shot in the neck. Oh, man. That was Billy Shark. Billy Shark hit him right in the neck. Nice job. Got so much stuff in the fields, like... Twisted should be working on hauling stuff. He's uh, hauling marble chunks right now. Okay. That's important, too. Kind of rather you worry about hauling, like, cloth and stuff, though. Cloth and rice and potatoes and more potatoes. Oh, and uh, maybe the uh, the medicine as well. 
Oh, it's only one. I don't care. Okay, the cougar's just kind of like lazing around now, not really doing anything much, but also bleeding to death. It's going well. It must be full. Full stomach. Ate the turtle. Didn't eat the colonists. It's good. Billy Shark's making a chair. Whose job is research again? That's Slick's, Slick's job. But he's worried about plant cutting right now, and that's that's fair. I don't know, though. Um, hey, Slick. Um, what are you doing right now? You're... Oh, you're, you're drafted. How long have you been sitting there drafted, Slick? Should, should tell me these things. Be like, hey, hey, boss, I'm drafted. I can't do anything that you've told me to do. Oh, well. Let's turn up the speed again. Watch the cougar a little bit closely here. Make sure that nothing goes wrong here. I think he's fine. I think he's going to just slowly bleed to death. And the bear is now eating this uh, this donkey that we were going to bring in. So let's just bring in the donkey, maybe. Officer should be on that, I think, soon. Cougar seems satisfied after eating that tortoise while slowly bleeding to death. So that's good. Not even bothering slick, so slick socks. Good stuff. Oh, he's downed. Someone should finish him off. Um, Slick, you can do that, right? Die, cougar. Good job. Allow, yeah. So, Twisted, whenever you wake up, the first thing I want you to do is haul the donkey. Actually, Twisted's not in that great shape, eh? Um, ravenously hungry. Okay, so okay, so screw that. First thing I want you to do is eat the food, a and then and then haul haul the donkey. Oh no, wait, you're you're already halfway to the donkey. Okay, sure, haul the donkey, and then eat the food. That order, good stuff. Now let's adjust this. Um, I'm gonna make some. Um, I'm gonna add Bill. I'm gonna tell it to cook fine meals, uh, even though we have no one who's capable of doing it yet. And forever, and details, um, radius, much smaller, please. Like, really small. And then drop on floor. So that way, if it's possible to make fine meals, we'll do it. And then simple meals will happen as well. Okay. Hey, we got some outer wall. Look at this, look at this, look at this. We, we, we're getting defenses. They're happening, slowly but surely. Meanwhile, we should start making traps, but, I mean, not that it matters right now, anyway. Uh, I am going to tell it to cut plants for this little area here. Oh, your clothes are looking mighty ragged there, Twisted. Oh, boy. We did we did make a tailoring thing, right? Somewhere? Oh, we, we told it to, but we didn't. Oh, yeah, quest available. I forgot there was another one here. Um, oh, the yeoman ceremony. Sure. The deserter. You know what? I actually kind of want to wait until the yeoman ceremony is, like, near to being gone. Because if we have some invaders, it would be great just to accept it and let these the Empire people kill our invaders for us. Um, right. So, the deserter. A recon sniper is calling from nearby. She has deserted the army of the Orange Empire and is being hunted by a loyalty squad. She wants to join us. Uh. Yeah, let's not do that. We don't want to make an enemy of the Empire. Yeah, yeah, garbage can. Garbage can. That quest gets the garbage can. This is going better and better. We, we need to not, like, totally neglect research quite so much, though. So I'm going to um, actually cancel all the jobs up here. A lot of these, a lot of these cut jobs aren't strictly necessary. So, um, cancel these ones, please. And maybe over here, and over here, and over here, but not the Ambrosia.
Hey, we got walls. Oh my. Actually, we should uh, change the animals' um, allowed areas. Um, I'm going to have to start from scratch, though, I think, because uh, right now, everything is allowed for the animals. We want them to only wander around inside the walls. Um, so let's do that. Let's do that now. We're going to... Um, wait, how do we do this? Manage areas. Uh, we're going to do a new area. We're going to get rid of that one. We're going to rename this. I mean, we should have just... I mean, we, we don't need two areas right now. Grazing animals. This is going to just take us a second to assign it. It's fine. Expand grazing animals. Uh, you can you can graze anywhere that is inside our walls, animals. Okay. Oops. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Man, this Randy Random, like, I know he gets, like, a hard time and stuff, but he's proven to be very, very helpful to our cause. He's not killing us. He's he's trying to give us a gradual entry into this, this mean and cruel world so that he can kill us later and we can know truly that we deserved it because we were given every opportunity to survive and we simply failed. Cargo pods, that's good. Wart. Well, we'll use that to make booze at some point, I'm sure. Um, meanwhile, we need to turn off the indoor spaces for the, the animal area. Um, architect, zone, zone, uh, clear allowed area, animals. Don't go indoors, please, guys. Okay. Might as well just do, do that, make it easy. And then over here... And then don't eat the crops, please. Crops are not for eating, unless you're human or something. Okay. Now, uh, go back to animals and grazing animals. Good. Hmm. Hey, Slick, why don't you prioritize research for a while? It's a good idea. Turn that down. There we go. Back to the good old research. Mmm, slow and steady. Slow and steady uh, will eventually at least cross the finish line, probably losing. But, but you know, you know, losing, winning, winning is not everything. And slow and steady finishes the race, even if it rarely wins. A yak is pregnant. Oh, joy. Hey, look, it's a bunch of boars. Maybe we should hunt these boars. We could also tame them, and then they'd become, like, combat boars. Hmm, I don't know. Maybe we should tame the boars and make them combat boars. I like that. Let's tame all the boars. Um, so someone needs to tame then, right? I mean, our guys all suck at taming, unfortunately. Winning was boring, but losing in style is fun. That's true! Very, very true. And we are well on the way to losing. Uh, we're not winning, that's for sure. I mean, we're not losing either, but, like, we're, we're trying. We're trying very hard to lose. And so far, Randy won't let us lose. So, Billy Shark is the one who would be taming. But, uh, we want him to grow and clean, uh, construct and clean a little bit more than we want him to tame. So, I don't know. Yeah. Well, a raid would only be helpful if we actually managed to successfully capture our enemies, and so far that hasn't happened. What we really want is, like, some, like, really, really kind event where, like, a cargo pod lands somewhere with, with a really, really good pawn in it, and we can just we just rescue them. Or but by rescue, I actually mean capture. But, but you know. There's muffalos over here. Killing one muffalo would give us food for forever. But we already kind of have food forever, so whatever. Major break. Billy. Always causing trouble, that Billy shark. Hungry, drowsy, unsightly. He's consuming a meal. That'll help him. He slept in the cold. Is it cold in here? Kind of surprised. 18 degrees in here. That's not cold. What are you talking about? Did he sleep outdoors for some reason? I don't know. Oh, 
Oh, and Billy got food poisoning to top it all off. So there should be a mental break after all of this, I'd imagine. Oh, well. Earbuds died. Okay, 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 okay. Well, charge up those earbuds, Twisted, and uh, we'll see you again real soon. Forced weather for pay. A vengeful m machine persona is threatening the tribe's people. Uh, the chief wants to send a message to the persona accepting responsibility for their transgressions. If we do, the persona will turn their anger on me. A weather control system will force the weather to become a foggy rain for 9.8 days. You know what? That doesn't sound that bad. I think we can handle foggy rain. So we could get advanced components, and th that would be really handy in like a long-term sense, but not really a short-term sense. Uh, we could get Glitter World medicine, which might well save, save one or two lives at some point and goodwill, but its value is much lower. And we don't care about a, a, a like a great bow, like whatever. So, um, I mean, the real choice here is between the goodwill and the components. Well, goodwill and medicine. Let's do goodwill and medicine. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna accept that. Seems seems fine. What just happened? Pods arrived. Oh, good. Okay, hey, Twisted, uh, after you finish eating, just haul, haul the, the medicine right away, please. Don't want it to go to waste. So it's going to be foggy and rainy for, like, a long, long time. But that's okay. We're not relying on uh, on solar panels or anything, so. No! Grizzly bears hunting our donkey? Not our donkey. Okay, Twisted, snap into action. Uh, Billy Shark, Slick Sacks, all hands on deck. Going to fend off this grizzly. Going go to go to, down to low speed here. Yeah. Shoot it. Shoot it, Twisted. Shoot it. Um, where's Billy? No, no, don't, 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 don't go out there. Don't go out there. Now go out there. Shoot it. Open the door so you get its attention, maybe? Oh, no, it's running away. You know what? That's good enough. We've driven the bear away, and the bear will die soon, and that's fine. You're not still hunting the donkey, are you? Oh, you are! No! I thought we were saved! Uh-oh. As soon as we stopped shooting the bear, it came back. The very next day, the bear came back. We thought it was a goner, but the bear came back. It just couldn't stay away, and the donkey's almost dead? What? No. The donkey's dead. It's terrible. Take our revenge, Twisted Officer. Take all the revenge, please. All the revenge. We could have saved that donkey, but we misunderstood the running away for being like something permanent. Well, we're going to eat the donkey. That's okay. Could be worse. We could, like, lose a donkey and not be able to eat a donkey. So, you know. Die, bear. Die! Die. Die like an earbud. There we go. All the grizzly. Boo earns. Hmm. At least we have lots of, like, animals sitting around here waiting to be butchered. That's something. What's Twisted doing if he's not, like, cooking right now? He's doing hauling. Oh, yeah, yeah, of course. I remember that. Um, but we're almost out of food, so we should go back to making your priority cooking. Stupid bear. Stupid bear. All right, well, we lost a donkey, but we gained a friend in a, in a tribe's people. They're, they're, they're our friends now. And the weather is not our friend, but the weather was never our friend to begin with. Weather is always the enemy, no matter whether it's good or bad.
So YouTube, with that little bit of wisdom into your ear holes, I will bid you adieu. We'll be back soon, so come on back soon and join us.